New tonight, all you pet owners, what if you could give your pet something that would help them live a longer, happier, and healthier life? I know you love your dog. I certainly do. You would do. probably do this in a heartbeat. Absolutely. And there is something they say. It's cheap and easy. And CBS4's Vanessa Borge reports. Mike White and his wife Laura loved their first Shih Tzu Cosmo so much, they got a second one named Vinny. They're very gentle. They're easy to, obviously, they're small, easy to pick up, friendly. They love to play, energy. I mean, they're, they're just great dogs. But a couple of years ago, 10-year-old Cosmo started having problems eating. We figured, okay, we understand he's getting older, but we didn't think it was, you know, common for him to have such digestive issues mm -hmm. every day. He had been having some issues uh, eating, and he wasn't able to keep his food down, and he was just kind of lethargic. They told their vet, Dr. Mike Hutchinson, at Animal General Hospital. He immediately suggested probiotics. 95% of all pathogens or disease-causing organisms um, come through the gut, through the mouth. Not through the skin, not through the respiratory tract, but through the gut. So it's important, it's vitally important that we have good balance. The probiotics for dogs are bacteria in a dry powder that is sprinkled on the food. When they eat, that good bacteria is swallowed and ends up in the large intestine where it balances the harmful bacteria that is causing problems. Hutchinson says it's very different than putting your dog on antibiotics. Antibiotic is anti-life. Basically, it's trying to kill cells, and that's what it's trying to do. The probiotics are pro-life. They're trying to repopulate good bacteria, the army of good guys, if you will, so that we don't need the antibiotic. Dr. Hutchinson recommends probiotics for all kinds of animals, dogs, cats, even exotic pets like chinchillas. He prescribes them to help with chronic bowel issues, bad breath, bad gas, and loose stools. My daughter got a new puppy, and I told her, have Fortiflora on hand. If that dog gets diarrhea, give it for seven or eight days. Repopulate the back. Don't call me. It will probably get better with you just giving this probiotic. Within a couple of weeks of starting Cosmo on probiotics, Mike and Laura saw a huge difference. He's able to keep his food down a lot better, and he's just more active and energetic. He's able to keep up with Vinny. We've seen such an improvement with Cosmo in the past couple of years that uh, he is just like a young pup anymore. So I noticed uh, since we started him on that, I think it was the best decision we made. And from the looks of things, Cosmo seems pretty happy about it too. Good boy. Veterinarians say if your pet is relatively healthy and on a good diet, you only have to give them probiotics for a couple of weeks every three or four months to get their system back in balance. The cost averages out to about a dollar a day, so that's about 15 bucks a quarter or 60 bucks a year. Vanessa Borge, CBS 4 News. Interesting. Cosmo is so cute. New tonight, all you pet owners, what if you could give your pet something that would help them live a longer, happier, and healthier life? I know you love your dog. I certainly do. You would do. probably do this in a heartbeat. Absolutely. And there is something they say. It's cheap and easy. And CBS 4's Vanessa Borge reports.